One teacher got through the learning curve of teaching virtually. In fact, she's taking the role full on because she believes there is a need for it. Many say she's gone above and beyond, particularly during the peak of the pandemic. Meet this week's Valley's top teacher for Madison County Virtual Academy, Krista Hunter. Krista Hunter. So do you know what, um, do you know what main idea is? Okay, what is main idea? Has taught for 23 years and two years ago made a pivot to virtual learning. I felt like um, it was just, it was kind of a challenge and I felt like there was a need there. Hunter worked with students virtually when they had the option during COVID before taking on the task permanently. I guess my bigger challenges were, was for example, just making sure that the kids were getting what they needed with me right here and them on a screen. So I kind of, it was kind of like a um, trial and error kind of thing at first because I wanted to make sure that they got the full experience that kids in the classroom were getting as well. Hunter says she gets to see her students online and in person. I do connect with kids virtually, but I do have kids that come in in small groups groups. So I kind of get the best best of both worlds because I still get kids that come in here and I work with small groups every single day. Hunter believes despite moving past the pandemic, there is still a place for virtual learning. I, I see that um, there's definitely a place for virtual learning and I see that we kind of have broken that barrier that we where kids really can, you know, do school from home. And I think that's been a big impact as well. No matter from one side of the screen to the other, helping kids learn is what drives Hunter every day. Um, just the fact that I love the kids and I treat my kids at school how my own kids treated. Basically, at the end of the day, kids want to know that you care. If they know you care, then they're willing to put forth the extra effort. Congratulations, Miss Hunter. And we get to see more of her. In fact, that moment when she got the surprise that she would be nominated as Valley's top teacher. See this and nominate a top teacher at fox54.com.